So check that out, man. That's that's the that's the volcano eruption. The sound of the eruption was heard in many parts of the world, as far away as the US. On Saturday, January 15th, the underwater volcano at Tonga erupted, about 65 kilometers north of the capital Nuku'alofa, triggering a tsunami that flooded Pacific coastlines from Japan to the US. It caused waves higher than a meter to crash into Tonga. Detailed information about its impact on Tonga is yet to emerge as communication remains cut off. GOES satellite imagery captured the eruption of the underwater volcano early Saturday morning. Tongans living overseas are facing an anxious wait for news of loved ones as the eruption cut the internet to Tonga. Even government websites and other official sources remained without any updates. According to the Tonga Geological Services, the plumes of gas, smoke and ash pouring from the volcano reached 20 kilometers into the sky. About 100,000 Tongans living in the 170 scattered islands are advised to drink bottled water and wear masks, as dust from the volcano could contaminate water supplies. The shock wave generated by the massive volcanic eruption in Tonga was felt in many parts of the globe. In India, it was recorded in Chennai, which is located 12,000 kilometers away from Tonga. It was recorded as a blip in the atmospheric pressure that suddenly spiked by around 2 hectopascals. This was around 10 hours after the eruption happened in Tonga. According to S. Venkatramanan, a PhD scholar from IIT Madras, the shockwave travelled at a speed of around 1,200 kilometers per hour to reach the skies of the city 10 hours after the event. He also said that the rare event was yet another reminder that nature had no boundaries.